Justice! Who do you want justice for? Black Lives Matter. Look at ass. This shit is so annoying. How you gonna get justice from the white man? <laughs> That's the dumbest shit I ever heard in my life. Hey, they fucking look cool. I can't do that shit. Where the police at? If he did that shit, we would went to jail. What block this shit? You can't block that. Oh, they, no, they would, they would, they would, they would. They, they'd get us off the street. They wouldn't go to jail. They just tell us to leave. Excuse me. Delusional. You ain't getting no justice. How you gonna get justice from the white man? He's a devil. Ain't gonna accomplish nothing. That's the, that's good though. They out there. Yeah. Shit getting stirred up. Yeah. You know. Tradition of the people. Yep. Yep. Was that Ezra's? Yeah. That shit was funny. Yeah, I couldn't even understand what the fuck they were saying. It's like Spanish. Or it's like, yeah, they speaking Spanish, bro. Even the girl that was in there, she said, what are they saying? I ain't even no Mexicans out here. Yeah. One of them was talking to It might have been a couple. I think it's like, I think it's like a multiple. Because they say they had like different signs, like Black Lives Matter one. Yeah. Poor people. I think they was protesting that. What building is that? You know what? Oh, I'm... That's the government. I think that's that building where you, uh... You go where corporations get to go to get get your LLC, uh, where you go get your vendor's license. I've been in that building. I got my vendor's license there. So they probably over there protesting because that's where you create your corporation is in that building. Hey, go watch them. Did I tell you about that movie? The Corporation? You go watch it. There's a movie on YouTube called The Corporation. You got to watch that shit. Oh, is your boy? I might as well keep my camera going. I don't want no goddamn coffee, that's for sure. Might as well just keep my camera going so I ain't got to edit nothing. Right. I had to get that madness on there. This bro, what bro? It's hot than a motherfucker. Shit. Dude, you making me sweat, bro. Oh, we should have went down. Oh, we could have been had that, huh? Yeah. Man, look at that, that bitch right there. She got a fucking flush that. She got a flush that for beer. Where? The uh, bitch with the uh, red socks, whatever. That's a woman. Taking that fucking testosterone and yeah. shit. They need to protest against that now. Nah, they're not. Because those same people to protest, they gone. They accept faggots and shit. Yeah. So they ain't gonna get no justice. No justice, no peace. How you gonna get justice from the devil? The same motherfuckers that fucking enslaved everybody, you gonna go to them and ask them for justice. Yeah. That accept for the blessing from the devil. You got your goddamn mind. You ain't gonna get no goddamn justice. Since they had signs that said stop systemic poverty. That shit is true though. That shit is a systematic fucking operation. Look at this bro. What you got an AK under that coat? They got bombs and shit up in there. <laughs> Look at this mother. <laughs> Ooh, that, that, that motherfucker was stinking, boy. Ooh. He gonna be stink up the whole neighborhood. Bro, if you homeless, you can take a shower. Yeah. Hello, shit. But you go to the library. I go to the library, there'd be homeless dudes in there washing up. You know what I mean? I wish I was homeless sometimes if I had the spirit to live like that. Take a couple quarters, take your ass to laundry back. 
She gonna wash her clothes in the river. It's like, uh, that shit will ruin them. <laughs> you, you go do it in the bathroom. Good. What's good? We was out there, uh, we had to go check out that protest. They were over here? Yeah, over here. Deep as That's what I was telling. I was like, how you gonna get justice from the devil? You going to beg into the same motherfucker that got you in this situation to him to help you and save you. That doesn't make no goddamn sense at all. You motherfuckers are gone. That's a, that's a scripture now. Let me take you. Is it? Yeah. Trying to hold from the nation that. Yeah, bring that out. We're going to get that. That shit is crazy. They all look dumb. You walk by, they didn't know what's going on. They probably want to help stop this shit. They don't know what's going on. I ain't got a clue about how shit really works. Woo! What? Today's a good day, though. The rain? I was. I rode my bike to work today. I was riding my bike in the rain. Gonna be raining missiles. Ah, shit. My shit still going. I got some little bonus footage on there. Oh yeah, we go. Huh? Oh yeah, go ahead, bring that up. Right, it's a. Uh, it's a uh, levitations four and a uh, seventeen. It says, "As for us, our eyes are yet filled." For our vain help and our watching, we have watched for a nation that could not save us. Oh yeah, you got people over there protesting. They, they I mean, that's, that's good. They got their spirit stirred up. They protesting this, uh, systematic poverty or whatever. But they going to the devil and like the devil, the one who made them poor as hell, broke as fuck. They gonna go to him and ask him to save them. Like they gonna ask the justice from the devil. Hey, where they do that at? You know what I mean? Usually back in the ancient world, if somebody was doing you like, like you went to war with him and just kill people. You know what I mean? You didn't go to your enemy. Oh, will you save me, enemy? Yeah. Can you love me? Right. Can you look at me as equal? What kind of dumb ass shit is that, bro? Ain't no, no motherfuckers in the top of Yeah, they probably not. They was, wasn't they? Yeah, that's what the Edomites They see They see the nations rising up against them. And that's that scripture in Job that uh, their children shall seek to please the poor. Seek to please the poor, man. Take that shit. Nobody trying for that bumpy dumb shit in the room, man. All that marching and dancing and singing and shit. It ain't never done a motherfucking thing. They, that's what, what mean, they want you to do. They right, want you to right. do all the little. Keep, keep shucking and jiving. Yeah. They don't like what we doing. I mean, we ain't out here being violent or nothing, but we giving people the real truth. You know what I mean? It's like, the real truth is fuck America. You know, fuck this government, fuck your court system. Fuck all this bullshit, bro. What we saying is, we don't want nothing y'all motherfuckers have to offer. Nothing, nothing. What they do, they try to make a, uh, what's called an agreement. Uh, yeah. It's like, uh, let's, let's get together, let's reason. And we said, we can't reason with this shit. You can't reason with the devil. How you gonna reason with the devil? Because something to uh, pay attention to, yeah, when you read this, the scriptures tell you that anybody that takes the mark of the beast, they're going to be destroyed, and there's no forgiveness for that. But there is for there is forgiveness for adultery, though. There's forgiveness for taking them trans women. Yeah. Revelation 13, 15, 16. He causes all folks to go to the great, 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 great,
marking it right there. That word mark itself. That word mark, look it up. That means to implant underneath. It's right here. Okay. Paragma. Implant underneath. It means. It means to go in. Because ain't nobody putting no mm -hmm. money inside nobody. That's the word for mark right here. Ain't nobody putting no money inside your forehead either. Nah, I just I thought money was like the mark. So he was he's been paying attention to something. He's been looking at something. That's probably IUIC or something. Yeah. That's the IUIC. No, that's the IUSPK doctrine. Strange women is the mark of the beast. Sin. That's dumb. You you can be forgiven of adultery, bro. The Lord said he forgive all. But the scripture said you cannot be. What's that scripture? It said he's going to be destroyed. Does that say right there? That's in 14. Where it says if you take that mark, bro, you're going to be destroyed. There's no. There's, once you take that mark, you condemned yourself. There's no coming back from that. But all these other sins we commit, you can come back from that. King David committed adultery. Yeah, King David committed adultery. You want you want to tell me King David had a mark to be? I guess what the Lord said, he had short, he said uh, short mercies of David. So if King David took the mark or whatever the hell, then he should have been through. And then they called Yahweh Shai the, the son of David. So they're gonna say he was the son of the mark of the beast? How dumb is that? So what does it sound like he was saying? He, he, Solomon got the Yeah, they hey that's that old tired ass doctrine saying the market of beast is sin or an embargo or some bullshit. You see the brothers is pushing, I ain't gonna say brothers, but pushing some philosophy now. Yeah, you're right, a philosophy. That's just dumb, bro. Philosophy. But when the Lord said you can be forgiven of all that, that don't, that don't make, that don't line up with the scripture. You know what I'm saying? Because we all believe in some bullshit philosophy. Bro, I used to believe in a fucking Anunnaki. The fuck? I should have been put to death for that shit. You know? The Lord will redeem you from that shit, though. I'll be making videos of entertainers and shit. Oh, shit. What that? Right till you know it. Fighting their shit. Yeah. <laughs> their body gets weak and they start to shift a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> like George, that George What's Bushman. Up, that George Bushman, the GW is the famous one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's a red. Oh, he's about to eye. Yeah. yeah. He did his tongue, he did a little slither. <laughs> yeah, that is not reptilians, bro. Oh, yeah, if the bitch is a reptilians that got superpowers, how can that bitch Barbara Bush just drop dead? Yeah, she's dead as hell. Ugly as hell, too. Why? You gonna tell me you a shapeshifter? You gonna shapeshift into the ugliest possible thing? He ugly as hell, boy. That bitch was creepy. You know, you know her fucking what's his name, George Senior. You know he was happy when that bitch died. Like about fucking, he probably killed her. Shit. Smothered that bitch with a pillow. <laughs> you know how they do it. Hey, that's how Esau does it. You remember that movie Caligula? Remember how uh, Caligula got into the powers? He killed fucking uh. uh uh, 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 Mur uh, Mur went into power and then started winning on a, a murdering rampage. Yeah, he saw him do that. He killed his own family all the time. Yeah, he killed the empty. <laughs> he smoked the empty. Hey, Jake did that shit too, though. Yeah. Like in the scriptures. And what was that bitch's name? Oh, was it Athaliah? Well, Jezebel's daughter. She started killing everybody just so <laughs> that her son could be the king and nobody else, you know? <laughs> she killed all the brothers, everybody. <laughs> Fucking wicked ass people. What's that scripture you got? Revelation 14 and 9. And the third angel followed him, saying, with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in the forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured with foul mixture, which is the cup of the nation, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels in the presence of the Lamb. Lamb, that means, that means the Lamb and the angels, the Lamb is your house side, that means they're coming back to destroy it. Anybody who took that, that's why he got us out here warning people. Because you supposed, because he's not going to destroy him because they didn't know. He could, though. But we out here warning people. They ain't going to have no excuses, bro. We out here telling people about the mark of the beast, you know? 
So, and a lot of people know about the microchip now. They be like, oh yeah, I know, I seen that, you know? But they still gonna take it. Because you got a lot of people saying they might claim they against it, but they still gonna take it. They gonna get weak. They gonna get hungry. Yeah, the hour temptation. Well, when that stomach start growling. You ain't lying, boy. Don't tell me you're talking, man. <laughs> Can't fucking wait, man. Yeah, I'd rather starve to death than live in this world anyway. So who gives a fuck? It's coming. It's coming. And everything playing out in the Middle East is going to help that shit bring it right in, man. Yeah, that's was beautiful. What happened? That shit I seen this morning, the Israeli snipers, Israelis, the Edomite snipers. Hey, I can't cut it. The Israelis. <laughs> Those Edomites, they killed 37 Palestinians. Could you imagine though? You said 45. Oh, now that, no, y'all, damn, I've been. Working, shit. The number don't went up. Because you imagine if there was a riot in the United States and our cops and military started, took out 45 people with a sniper. That shit would... But, but them devils over there, they get a pass for it. You know what I mean? They'll do it, they get a pass. And Americans will back them up 100%. Yeah, you go ahead and kill them goddamn Palestinians. You know? Because everybody been brainwashed thinking that they the real Jews. And they get a pass for everything. And everybody's, everybody's always supposed to feel sorry for a fucking a fake dude, you know? You're supposed to feel sorry for them. What the fuck them devils, bro? I hope Iran rain goddamn missiles on them. Bro, yeah, they, they are acting like bitches. Hey, but Iran did put a call out, though. They said everybody just need to come together and team up on these devils. They gonna do it too, man, cause Iran's at that tipping point. After Trump pulled out that nuke deal, Iran's like, nah, we done with you devils. Yeah, it's like, we're, we're fucking done with y'all. We ain't trusting you fucking devils ever again. Revelation 2 and 9, I know thy works in tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich, and I know the blasphemy of them who say they are Jews and are not, but are of the synagogue of Satan. Right, this Bible says he knows the blasphemy of them to say they are Jews and are not. That's those devils over there in the Middle East claiming to be Jews. How they gonna be Jews when the real Jews in the Bible are dark-skinned people? Hey, ain't, ain't no dark-skinned, only black Jews they got over there is what? The ones that came from here. From America that migrated over there. Who are actually they're really those are real Israelites, you know what I mean? So you got these fucking bro, and I, I just rode my bike through Bexley this morning. You look at how these devils are living, man. These motherfuckers got basketball courts, tennis courts, they live in mansions, giant swimming pools. It don't none of them work. Oh, that's them fools over there. They, oh, they gone now. They protested for what, a half hour? They got toys. Goddamn crickets. They're fucking hungry. They're hungry. But, they, but they, they're not going to go to the protest the fake Jews, are they? Because who, who controls the financial system? The so-called Jews. Even Esau. He controls all that shit. He printing the money. Look here, man. You know, America. What? You know, notice every time something happens, you know, they force attack, the chemical attacks, whatever. They call it other nations, they all got some cowards, yep. all this, all that. America always and Jews over here, so much. They point the finger at everybody, but look, I just noticed that, uh, I think I learned yesterday that, uh, you that nigga that died, uh, David Wapschow, yeah. this nigga funded, uh, this one nigga, I forgot his name, I think Alfred something, he funded him to do a study on, uh, sex with animals, Whoa. sex with, uh, Whoa. and it's the worst part, uh, 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 orgasms and little infants and shit. What? So can you imagine, can you imagine this nigga, you know what I'm saying, but like the point, this nigga is, Point the finger, everybody, y'all with y'all doing this, y'all doing that, but you behind the scenes, uh, uh, what's it called, funding shit, and also he, he funded the, uh, the, the what's it called, the, the story, uh, the shit where you can't make, uh, uh, niggas can't make babies, whatever, sterilization, that shit, like Costa Rica, or some shit, some oh, yeah, I heard about that one, yeah, that nigga, he's funding all this shit, doing all this shit behind the scenes, but, yeah, but in the front, everybody look at him as he's like, he's the children of God, but behind the scenes, this nigga's disgusting, it's nasty, it's just when you talk to the herd of that. And you know the Rockefellers were crypto Jews. They got people who done, done trace them back. They're fucking Edomites. They're crypto Jews. You know they, they changed their names. You know back in the early uh ter back in the early uh the early 1900s, it was common because everybody back then knew they were a bunch of devils, right? So everybody used to change their name. Oh, even though I like Jack Kirby, but his real last name was uh 
It's not Kirby. It was a, some, what was it, Kurtzenberg or something like that? Stan Lee's real last name was Stanley Lieberman. But they got always high the fact that they're Jews. You know, I think them two good dudes are Jakes. But you had a lot of uh, Hollywood producers, actors, all kind of people change their last name so you wouldn't know they was a, a fake Jew. Back in the day, everybody hated them devils, man. You, you know what happened? You know, like back in the day, you would, uh, if you dated a so-called Jewish woman, an Edomite woman, you get ostracized, bro. People look at you like you're a piece of shit. Like, why are you fucking with them? Go ahead. Let's skip the room on this one. This uh, Ezekiel 26, 36 and 3. It says, Therefore, prophesy and say, Thus saith the Lord God, uh, because they have made you desolate, because he have made you desolate and swallowed you up on every side, that you might be a possession unto the residue of the even, and ye shall, uh, and ye are taken up in, in the lips of talkers, or in, in the family of the people. You look at the word family it means like you're known to do something bad. That's what it, look at niggas though. Like, he's a nigga, but you know they lock the doors when you walk past all that yep. shit. Now, let me skip to uh, verse. Uh, are they racist? Oh, did y'all see that uh, that video that went viral on the internet about that bitch, that fat white bitch? to call the cops on some jakes for barbecuing oh. well they was probably eating pork that's a good but they was pretty she pretty much got scared because black people were existing and so she called the cops Sorry. pretty much that's what happened did you see that video yeah, yeah. that they, shit is crazy with another, with again, the and then the fucking when the cops came she was crying like she was a victim man they should have killed that bitch that's bro a vibration that's in the there's a lot of division. Man, these these devil these fucking white people are starting to show their true colors, yeah, man. It's always been here, right? They get bold now. Well, I told you there's a story in the news too. There's a cop out with a flat a black a so-called uh, he's an Israelite a black cop out with a flashlight looking for evidence of shell cases. They called the cops on the cop. They yeah. said there was a su suspicious black guy out here with a flashlight. <laughs> this shit's crazy. It's fucking crazy. Right. Go ahead. Let's get to verse 6 in uh, Ezekiel 36. It says, Prophesy therefore concerning the land of Israel, and send to the mountains, to the hills, to the lands, to like the rivers, and to the valleys. Thus saith the Lord God, uh, Behold, I have spoken in my dusty and in my fury, because ye have borne the shame of the heathen. We yep. Have, oh, sorry. Go ahead. You got it. It's like we have borne the shame of the heathen. We're looked at as the, uh, the, the most dirtiest, lowest people on earth. But really, in reality, the so called white men, the Jews over there, chiefly, they're the, they're the lowest people on earth. It says, Therefore, does say the Lord God, and also they, they look at us like if we're gone, the world will be in a better place or some shit. You know what I'm saying? But really, if you take out the so-called white man, this world will be in a better place. You know what I'm saying? It said, Therefore, does say the Lord God, I have lifted up my hands. Surely, the heathen that are about you, they shall bear, they shall bear their own shape. So that's what the scripture says: the, 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 the skirt can be lifted up, and everybody's gonna see who these motherfuckers really are. Now, you saw what that bitch that said about Barbara Huber, that famous author and philosopher and whatever other madness that Edomite is in. She said they're going to have to start exterminating us. You know what I'm saying? They've been doing it low key. Right. You know, uh, right. uh, slowly exterminate. Well, first of all, they exterminate uh, Israelites through abortion. Right. What that bitch say that started uh, Planned Parenthood? Um, uh, Margaret Singer. Margaret Singer. She made another comment that uh, let's, they want to keep it a secret that they're trying to exterminate so-called black race man. and hillary clinton that was one of her uh role models hero. one of her the idols hero. one of her right. heroes right. yeah right she got the margaret sandler award she got a award like it's the heisman trophy and shit to be a wicked devil man yeah this country is all about eugenics you, right. the average person don't even know what the word eugenics mean <laughs> you know what i mean they never even heard of it they don't know what's going on you ain't bro. supposed to eat pork either right bitch you see how she walked over okay. yeah. the look on it's all right. I'm not worried about these demons. I really do too, man. Fucking demons, man. You finish with that yeah. Psalms 28 and 3. Draw me not away with the wicked and with the workers of iniquity. Yeah, we hate, right? We hate these motherfuckers, man. Right. He's not trying to be. And Esau, he's the ultimate worker of iniquity. Ain't no wrong with hating motherfuckers, man. Hell no. You know? Ain't no wrong with that. <laughs> the Lord said, hate the evil, love the good. Ain't no right. That's common goddamn sense, bro. Should be. Love your enemies. You got me fucked up. Ain't what it means. <laughs> hey, what's that scripture in the pocket, bro? It's rust iron. It's rusty. I get it. Bro. Right. Draw me not away you with can. the wicked and with you the workers of iniquity, which speak.